Hi, I'm Kalle Roselli, Product Manager for EFLA Connectivity Products. We are here in Finland at EFLA Factory and today we are going to take a look how to assemble our new KDL10 primary connector kit. Tools you need for the assemble. Cable cutters, pliers, size 6 crimping tool, 29mm spanner and a marker pen. KDL10 is delivered in a plastic bag like this. The connector kit contains installation instructions, connector housings, metal pins, EFLA lock, grounding pin, measurement tool and a paper towel. On the installation instructions you can find correct cable sizing, recommended crimping tools, instructions for peeling, crimping and assembly, note the measurement tool. Correct peeling is very important for the connector water tightness. Peeling instructions are different for the cable with single and dual insulation. Mark the cable with the correct peeling segments. When cable with single insulation is used, peeling is done only for one segment. Peel 16 mm of the core visible. Check that the peeling is done correctly. Crimp metal receptacle to the cable. Use size 6 crimping tool. Crimping is done on two places. Make sure to turn the cable 90 degrees between the crimps. Put the guiding pin into the metal receptacle. Remove the protection cap, slide the cable into the housing. Place the measurement tool into the receptacle. Use your thumb to stop the cable correctly. Remove the measurement tool and the guiding pin. Wipe the connector surface clean from any silicon leftovers. Other purpose for using guiding pin is to prevent silicon getting into the metal pin. Tighten the cable clamp first by hand and then by 29mm spanner as tight as you can. If you have a torque key, then tighten to 8 newton meters. The connector is installed normally to a transformer. Secure the connection with EFLA lock. With EFLA lock, the connection can tolerate 25 kg pulling force before opening. Assembly of the male connector is done same way as a receptacle. Start by peeling the cable and remember the importance of accurate peeling. Mark the cable in correct places. Peel 16 mm so that the core is visible. Check correct peeling. Crimp the pin in two places. Remember to turn the cable 90 degrees between the crimps. Install the plug housing. Remove the protection cap. Slide in the cable. Use the measurement tool and your thumb to stop the cable at the correct place. 
clean the connector from extra silicone. Tighten the cable clamp first by hand and then by a 29mm spanner as tight as you can. If you have torque key, then tighten to 8 newton meters. Connect the connector to a transformer. Secure the connection with EFLA lock. And that's it, you are all done. Thank you for watching the video, I hope it was helpful to you. Bye!